Bonjour and welcome to the Tarot of Claude. Today I'm going to be doing your daily tarot reading for Friday the 29th of October. These are general readings, they will not resonate with everybody. Just take what applies to your current situation and discard the rest. I hope you're doing well and that you've had a good week. I can already smell the weekend. <laughs> so what are the energies for Friday, the 29th of October? Okay, so you get the Three of Cups. Now this is very appropriate for the um, weekend energy actually. So three is the number of uh, growth, beginning of abundance. Cups is to do with your feelings and your emotion. So this is a, um, a card of, you know, happy times, um, socializing, going out, um, you know, being happy in your own skin and um, yeah, seeing other people. So yeah, as I said, kind of fitted for the weekend, isn't it? for your Friday. So let's see what's happening. This social period. Now daily readings can resonate a couple of days after they've, they've aired, you know, because it's all about energy. So let's see. of wands, the three of wands, and the chariot. Let me move it here so you can see it better. The hierophant, the star, and the fool. There's a lot of major arcana. The two of cups, the page of cups, and the four of cups. bottom of the decks you have the nine of cups okay so in the near past you have page of wands three of wands and the chariot so pages are um, they bring you messages and wands is to do with passion excitement um, so this could be a news that excited you in the past um, or it's also sometimes the uh, indication of a change of direction, a new path. And this brought you the Three of Wands, which is the beginning of the growth um, of whatever it is that news or that new path was for you. Um, and you get then the Chariot, which is a major arcana, so it's a major influence in your, on your life path. Um, something to do um, that's going to make you... Uh, progress basically and develop as a person and the chariot is a card of um, you know someone who's very determined and goes for it and fights long and hard to get what they want and it's a victory card because you've triumphed you've arrived um, so in the past you've, you've had um, some kind of victory um, it, the chariot also talks about um, movement like any kind of movement. So we can talk about traveling, um, we can talk about um, relocating, so it could be pretty much anything. It could be you in the past um, having heard some news, started a new um, adventure um, and you know it was really exciting and you put the time and effort in and the work and, and you succeeded. It could be you having relocated for a job promotion um, that kind of thing. So, as I said, general reading and take what resonates um, for you. In the present, you get three major arcana, which obviously um, caught my eye because it means that you are in an intense um, life progression um, happening right now. The Hierophant um, 
is uh, it, it has layers okay so it can represent um, someone who gives you counsel it can represent a very big firm company because if you think about it in medieval times you had uh, two big powers you had the king and then you had the church so this could be that it could also talk about a marriage it could also talk about um, your belief system generally speaking and then you have the star now the star is many many things as well it can be a healing card but it's a card of hope divine or universe guidance you know your spirit team whatever you believe in uh, getting your wish fulfilled that kind of thing and the fool is taking a leap of faith um, and so what I'm getting from this is that you are being guided um, to take a leap of faith regarding the, the Hierophant and as I said the Hierophant could be in your work life an institution a company that you work for or it could be you um, having a change in your belief system um, or it could be a marriage and um, you're being told you know th this is fated um, trust trust us basically um, take the leap of faith that could be that too because in the near future you get the two of cups the page of cups and the four of cups two of cups uh, relationships very very positive relationship cards you know people who are who fulfill in each other emotionally I think the card represents that really nicely his pouring is um, emotions into her which and she's receiving and she's got a, a hand directly on his heart so these this is you know like the perfect match uh, in a relationship page of cups um, it's the second page you get so a news uh, a bit of news coming your way to do with feelings um, a new path a new direction um, that kind of thing and four, the four is a number of stability, strong foundation. So four of cups is emotional stability. Um, now sometimes it can lead to boredom, but I'm not feeling that vibe at all. Um, I am getting the uh, message that there's going to be some news regarding this relationship um, that's going to provide emotional stability because in the um, energies at work, in the background you have the nine of cup which is the wish fulfillment card so nine is number of achievements so it's you getting what you wished for so I'm seeing that although in the near past that there, there's had to be um, you know some some kind of you know work to be done I wouldn't say it was a hard fought battle because that, that's a bit extreme but you know you, you had to, to fight to make this work and to, because you saw the beginning of growth of, of this relationship this is having a profound effect on you right now um, and you know it is saying to you to basically take a leap of faith this is divinely or your spirit team is guiding you um, towards this um, and as I said this could be um, marriage we could be talking marriage here because these two people here in the two of cups are perfectly suited and there's going to be some news that's going to bring the emotional stability um, and ultimately the um, the wish fulfillment now it could also be um, something to do with a work relationship it does not have to be a love relationship it could be at work where you know you, you've had to um, you went on 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 some kind of project um, you saw the beginning of growth and you had to work hard and passionately to get there and you you succeeded and now um, the company is looking at you um, in a different way and they're going to take a leap of faith and you're going to collaborate with somebody at work um, and this is going to bring you your wish fulfillment and emotional stability so it could also be this we have the card of three of cups which as i said is socializing happy time celebrating um so you could have been celebrating this as well um 
so yeah, it could work for um, work or for a love relationship. Um, but th this is, um, yeah, this is this is nice for a Friday <laughs> reading. So um, I hope you've enjoyed your journey for the cards with me. Um, I also offer monthlies if you didn't know, and I leave a card um, in the corner there somewhere. Uh, if you want to check them out for November. Um, please let me know if any of it resonated in the comments box below. I'd love to be able to connect with you guys. Um, and um, I hope I'll see you again soon. Uh, thank you so much for stopping by my channel. And until next time, au revoir.